It is called the Wonder Brow Long Lasting Brow Gel and Dual Precision Brush. Brush. Now, I think this is a great product for someone who really loves a good defined brow but doesn't want it to be too intense. And since I already have some on, um, I'm not going to put it on. I Clearly, you can tell I'm not a huge... Um, I don't love super intense brows. I like them kind of to blend in with my face. But um, yeah, so all you'll have to do with this, it's really, really simple. You have this um, tool right here. You have a spoolie and then a little eyebrow brush. Um, one second. Let me see. I have long nails and I usually don't have nails. And so usually it's really easy to open things, but I guess it's a little, with my nails it's kind of hard. Okay, so. So the first thing you'll do, um, you'll apply this on, so you have, okay, the applicator, which is like in here, and then you'll apply that onto this brush. And this is for like bacteria purposes so that you're not just putting something on your face and putting it right back into the bottle because breeding grounds for bacteria to grow. Um, so you'll just, I think this is definitely a learning, there's a learning curve to this where you'll just brush it on. I like to start more towards the arch first to get most of the product on that part of the eyebrow because for me that's where it's like the most sparse but also if you start here, it's going to be really intense and you want it to look natural. So you'll, um, ooh, got a fuzz in my, hair, in my eye. So yeah, you'll angle it this way. This is how I do it. You angle it this way and then you brush the rest of it onto this side, onto this part. And then really quickly before it dries, you want to take the spoolie and fluff it out. Just brush it out up and out is how I like to do it. Um, and I have it in the color black-brown because I have pretty dark hair slash eyebrow hair. Um, this is also waterproof and transfer-proof, which is great for when you're at the beach and if you want to make sure you have some eyebrows, which I definitely didn't think about that when I was at the beach. But um, I would if, you know, in other circumstances. But um, so this is a really, really great product to try out. And I know eyebrows can be really... Um, what's the word? Intimidating to start if you aren't used to doing them yourself or if you're used to doing them a certain way and then switching it to something else. Um, but this is a pretty easy, like it, it, the application is really, really easy and seamless. So I feel like this would be a great product to start out with. Um, so it's waterproof, smudge proof and transfer proof for days. They put days in bold letters. So they must be telling the truth on that. Um, oh, and it's also vegan. That's really great. So, yes, this is the Wonder Brow Long Lasting Brow Gel and Dual Precision Brush. So we got the brow gel, we got the brush. So that's the first product. You guys let me know if you have any questions on that one. Oh my gosh. Okay. Wow, y'all. I totally added the wrong one. Okay, because they, they're the same um, brand. I put the lip plumper. Okay, sorry. Um, I'm going to talk about the lip plumper before I switch to show you guys to present the um, brow gel. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so this is the Wonder Kiss Lip Plumping Gloss. And I can put this on right now because I don't have anything on my lips. But I had this on earlier, and it's really nice. It has a really soothing, um, just, like, refreshing um, feel to it and when I put on gloss I like to go all out it's a it's a plumping um, gloss so it's gonna there's like this dermaporting technology um, and it's just a clear color so you can actually put it on really anything but I like just having nothing on my lips and just adding the gloss because it kind of gives you a little more interest but like not too overdone so it says, um, it says that it's an, an, an extreme lip plumping gloss that gives you hydrated and naturally plumping lip looking lips in under two minutes. So it's working its thing right now. 
I already have like pretty full lips, so these will just make them even fuller. <laughs> Um, yeah, it, has, it says that it will give you a sensation of heating and cooling for plumper. I really like this. It goes on really light. So one thing I don't usually like about lip glosses is when they go on really thick. And some people might actually like that consistency. But for me, I think the lighter, the better, because, you know, when you're the whole thing where you're like outside and it's windy and your hair just gets in and then it gets just sticky and greasy and on your hair like that doesn't happen as much because this is much more like a lightweight mm, I can feel it it's activating in my lips um, but I really do like this lip plumper and once again it's the wonder kiss lip plumping glass and I believe this is also vegan uh, maybe it's not it doesn't say it here and you don't want to just like assume 